Hello, and welcome to another episode in Green Frog's Trackside Travels video series. In this episode, we will visit a famous railroad junction in West Chicago, Illinois. This junction is where Union Pacific's former Chicago and Northwestern Geneva subdivision crosses Canadian Nationals' former Elgin, Joliet, and Eastern's Leakton subdivision. JB Tower controls all movements through the junction. It's rare to see an active interlocking tower in the 21st century, so this spot is indeed unique. This northbound is heading toward Wisconsin on the CN Main Line. Next, we catch another northbound CN train. Before CN's purchase of the EJ&E in 2009, traffic on the J was light, allowing Union Pacific freights and metric commuter trains nearly unlimited access through the junction. Currently, however, CN runs upwards of 20 trains per day past the tower, making things considerably more complicated. While metro trains always take priority, UP trains often have to wait their turn to pass through the CN-controlled interlocking. Union Pacific gets into the action, sending two eastbounds past JB Tower.
The trains move at nearly the same speed to the junction. A westbound Metro commuter train is next by JB Tower. The Leafton sub again comes alive with another northbound behind a CN ES40DC and a former LMS C40-8W. An eastbound UP auto rack train behind a pair of SD70Ms is next at JV Tower. operates this line left-handed, a tradition that was passed down from the Chicago Northwestern. This means that eastbounds typically operate on the north track and westbounds usually run on the south track. Metro commuter trains further illustrate the left-handed operation of the Geneva sub.
reach the end sends yet another northbound through the interlocking. The ceaseless racket created by freight cars hitting three diamonds is music to our ears. It's UP's turn again, as it sends one train from each direction past JB Tower. We have time for one more train from each railroad. CN finally sends the southbound through town, picking up speed as it slams the diamond.
our last train for this episode, a westbound auto rack train behind a pair of UPS D70Ms, brings about a fitting close to this episode of Trackside Travels. We hope you enjoyed a look at this exciting railroad hotspot. If you decide to visit, please steer clear of JB Tower. CN does not take kindly to trespassers. All of these views were taken from a public sidewalk. Please follow Green Frog's YouTube channel or like our Facebook page to get updates on future episodes of Trackside Travels. Please stay safe and happy rail fanning.